Once upon a time, it would have been taken by the highest ranking member of society that was present and secretly sold on the black market. But these days, it seems, Egypt is trying to protect its exasperating array of ancient artifacts that are still being uncovered. And in the latest find, the cameras of the world got a glimpse into an ancient Egyptian artifact that hadn't seen the light of day for thousands of years. Wait, till you hear this. Unearthed at Luxor and described as the Granodorite Colossus of Horus, this unique find was one of the biggest surprises in Egypt of the year. And the statue is missing the legs and the arms are broken, but the head and torso are very well preserved and unearthed by a joint expedition between Egypt and German archaeological missions. The 1.85 meters tall statue depicts the ancient Egyptian deity Horus, wearing the divine pleated kilt held around the waist with a horizontally pleated belt with no inscription on the back end. Found in the ruins of the temple of millions of years in Luxor's West Bank, the discovery comes in the context of a long-term restoration project of the statue of Memnon and the temple of King Amenhotep III, which began in 1998 with the aim of the project to preserve the remains of the temple and rebuild it again. The discovered statue was in good condition and of an important artistic, scientific, and archaeological value as it would contribute to presenting the full image of the temple, especially after its collapse after a devastating earthquake in the 28th century BC. The statue in question is currently undergoing restoration and the mission, meanwhile, will continue to search for the missing legs of the statue. And we just wanted to bring this piece of news relating to history to you guys, short and sweet. Massive statue of Horus discovered, comment below. And as always, thank you for watching.